Hey guys, I um, just want to kind of do an update video since, you know, I did my unboxing video uh, a few days ago. Um, and just kind of want to, you know, let y'all know what's going on and getting back into things. First off, I've been kind of, you know, out of the loop for a while. Um, mainly because, um, you know, just the financial situation. Economy's not great right now, so, you know, to catch up on bills and, and just get you know, car repairs and stuff like that done. Um, I took a time off and, and sold a whole bunch of my gear and just kind of, you know, focused on, on getting things right in my life so that uh, I could get back to doing things that I really love, like, you know, you know, making YouTube videos. I'm, I'm new to the community and, and I've really, you know, taken to this and really, you know, want to get heavily into this like the rest of the community. Um, I guess a, a big thing is, is um, you know, it's going to take me time to get stuff back, and and my my main goals for this this channel, I guess, is going to be I'm going to try to produce at least one video a week, um, just because you know I I have a lot of things going on in my life. I have you know a little girl, I have to take care of her on my week off, and, and then I work for a week, you know, seven days on, seven days off, so I work for a week at a time. And it's just hard to get around to making videos and getting them uploaded and, and you know, all that. And and also materials. Um, I'm going to have to start thinking of something else to do because, you know, I'm just, the way money is so tight with the way things are now that I don't get to buy a whole lot of things and don't have a lot of stuff to review. But um, hopefully I'm going to get back into things and, and have some video for you guys, um, you know, at least once a week and maybe more than that. And, you know... I'm, hoping to be, you know build up some more subscribers and um, you know I'm gonna be looking for something for my uh, giveaway coming up because I said it about 50 subscribers I wanted to have a small giveaway and I'm at 50 now and I really appreciate you guys subscribing to me while I've been away uh, it's been about three months I've been away so I mean you know thank you guys for, for the ones hanging in there and then the new ones and I'm gonna try to get y'all something to you know compete for and try to win um, but other than that, guys, I'm just trying to get back in the swing of things and, and get some, some videos done. And um, I'm just going to kind of give you an idea of what some of the things I want to get reviewed. And, and some of the stuff's been reviewed, but I'm going to give my spin on things. Um, a few knives I've gotten um, I'm going to get reviewed is um, my uh, Mini Deja Vu, which was in my unboxing. Um, you know, I'm really, really, really loving this knife. Um, other than the, the whole detent issue, because, you know, it has basically if you, yeah no detent to it so other than that this is i mean i love the, the g10 handles that are sculpture like wood the, the pocket clip which is deep carry the blade shape you know open hole everything about this knife is is, is really cool and i'm really really enjoying this knife and like i said um you know the unboxing video i got a police and an endure and i sold both of those because really I, i'm not a fan of the endures and um, the police was just a little too large, so you know I got something else. So um, I got another bench made with some of that money. Um, I had an unboxing for that, and I just didn't get around. I mean, it didn't come out like I wanted it to, so I'm just gonna have to end up doing a review on it instead. But um, you know, got this uh, mini grip uh, with the sand colored uh, FRN handles and the black coated Tanto plain edge blade, which I couldn't find anywhere else than knifeworks.com. And when I found this and they were having the bench made sales month, you know, this just, I mean, I had had another knife in mind to buy with that money that I, that I got from the Enduring the Police and well, end up with this. And then uh, I got probably my most favorite Spider Co to date other than Sage 2, which is the one I want, which I just can't get around to getting because I can't find one that I can afford. but. Um, is going to be uh, the Delica, and I an end up getting me a nice full flat ground one. I've been really wanting these, you know. I kind of took the the Endura money that I made and, and bought this one, and I got with the blue FR and handles, which is what I also wanted because you know, I just really like blue is my favorite color, and I really like this blue. Um, another knife that I'm carrying and also really enjoying. So some reviews coming up on that stuff. Um, I also got in a poor f a poor fish unboxing, which again it did not come out like I wanted to. I screwed up and left my personal information right here on the screen. So you know I'm getting used to this whole MacBook thing. Uh, also I got a MacBook. That's what I'm filming this on. That's what I'm going to be filming on from now on is um, is my, my MacBook that I got from a guy I worked with. Um, he had 
you know, thought it had died on him and gave it to me, and I, I fixed it right up and been using it ever since. But, um, so, uh, you know, in that poor fish unboxing, I, I had to add a little extra to get my, my Delica and my Sharp Maker. Um, it actually cost me 20 you know, $6 less to go ahead and buy this extra item that I'm going to end up reviewing um, than just to buy the knife and the Sharp Maker, and that would be the Phoenix. E01, um, which I think I'm having that weird, you know, if this ends up being backwards, I'm sorry. I know that uh, Zippo this knife, that was having the whole issue with a lot of his first videos, and I don't know how to turn it around, so maybe, you know, Zippo, if you're watching this, tell me how to, you know, unmirror my images. But, um, you know, I'm going to get a review on this little keychain light. It, it seems like an awesome light so far. It puts out a good, I mean, it's 10 lumens, but it puts out a really good, you know, beam for, you know, a 12, $12 flashlight and lastly I'm actually going to review on something other than knives and gear is going to be my uh, XDM 9mm um, I've you know I'm, I'm an avid gun nut if you will and um, you know I used to be really heavy into it before I got into the knife thing on YouTube because I found that I could actually afford to buy more knives than I can guns at a time and I can buy you know five or six knives for what I usually spend on one gun but you know this is my favorite handgun this is my, my my house handgun and my range gun so I figured you know I know there's reviews on it but I'm gonna get a good um, review on this this one right here but you know guys that's that's just some stuff to come so um, hopefully it'll uh, it'll all work its way out and uh, really appreciate you guys subscribing I'm gonna get get you something to win and uh, you know till I see you next time Later.